How's it going guys? Welcome back to Figment. So it turns out I would kind of abandoned this before and when you light up that thing it makes it so that this little platform moves back and forth. It doesn't just move the once. Oh, it's gonna leave me behind. Oh, there we go. It makes a nice full path for me. There we go. So I can get the remembering this time. I don't have to leave it behind. Way to go, Dusty! Maybe you can recover all the remembrings now that you're already out of your chair. Go away, you jerk. I never want to play with you again, Todd. So I wonder if that's someone who had been mean to me? Or if I'm Todd, like if I'm in Todd's mind and he's remembering a time that he had been mean to someone. But now here I am back to where I was before. Freedom Isles, the creative center of the subconscious mind. Ah, Freedom Isles. Isn't it great to be back in the creative part of the mind? Nah. Jeez. Well, you can be a big grump about it, Dusty, but I like it. There's like loots growing out of the pieces of grass. There's a lighthouse thing made out of a sh seashell or something. Fun little bouncy shrooms all over the place. You can you can try and cheer up once in a while, Dusty. Hey, visitors, how delightfully inconvenient! Oh my God, this guy has so many mouths and a big giant hook face. Let's find out. Is there's like this goofy tuba noise in the background, like whoop, 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 whoop. Like he's a big silly creature. He's not. He's not scary like that other nightmare was. He seems like he's a funny guy. Go away! I'm not coming out with a plank man just down the road. <laughs> I don't know what accent that is. It's just delightful. Go away! I'm not is delightful an accent? People who come from the town of delight, but that guy didn't look like a bad guy. I mean, he kind of does, but he seems like a goofball. I want to be friends with him. Ah, I'm the plague you fear of disease. I come with waff and rotten cheese. What the hell? He's singing at me like he's some kind of goofy, like Scottish lemon grab or something. Okay. Oh, whoops! I can't go back that way. Don't say. What's this? Okay, so I, I, I turned this. Now I can use it to blow away. Alright, I can blow away the clouds, but don't I want to blow away all of this as well? Nothing can be done there. I can blow this away though, can't I? There we go. Collect the nice big helping of endorphins. Keep things nice and bright. If I grab this, is it going to come back? Yes, yes it does. So I better make sure I keep that in place there. Make sure this dragonfly stays nice and dizzy so I can keep all that blown out of the way. Hey there, Mr. Earthworm. I sure wish you had more earth to hang out in. I'm sorry that it seems to be kind of crumbling away from you. Oh, I need to find a red battery this time. There's actually color coatings to the batteries. My endurance neurons actually matter this time. Ooh, look, did you see the, the symbols on his chest kind of lit up when he did that? Ah! Weird little rodent creatures that shoot mud and filth at me. These guys are much more cuter than the, the purple tentacle monsters that went along with that purple nightmare monster. That guy was actually kind of kind of spooky, just like a little bit, not a whole lot. But this other guy with his weird goofy hook nose and his silly little pet mongrels, he's just my favorite. I, I hope he sticks around. Ooh, a green battery as well while we're at it. I don't really want to steal this person's red battery if they need it for anything. Ooh, thanks for putting the kettle back on. I think I accidentally skipped the tiniest bit of dialogue there. What's that gonna do? Is that gonna it's floating over right by the, the earthworm there? What else do you have to say? All right, well, thank you. You just leave that on and... Oh, shit. Uh, did you need that? Hmm. Maybe I should investigate and see if that I need that kettle on for anything first. Look at this giant trumpet playing music outside the hill. Also, this water that flows up. Everything in this world is just so whimsical and nice. Okay, you know what? You turn your kettle on. Yeah, and then turn the kettle back on. Thank you. And now let's let's kind of get a vantage point and see what maybe that 
is going to in affect. Oh! I did not realize I was walking right across the earthworm before. I just somehow did not piece that together. Also, his kettle being on doesn't actually seem to directly affect anything, so I'm just going to go back and take that battery again. I'm sorry, but I need it. If you were just going to do it to make steam and not actually do anything with that steam, then I'm sorry, but it feels an awful lot like I need it more than you do. Can we push the two winds together to do anything? Doesn't really seem to make a difference. All right, we'll just use it to blow the, these stinky mud clouds out of the way. Completely clouded by all this filthy gas. Filthy, stinky gas. That damn scoundrel. He's not actually, like, killing anyone or hurting anything. He's just leaving stinky gas all over the place. Oh, and his little, his little rat finks. Little rat fink creatures. Get back here. You goofy little thing one and thing two. I'll whirling blade you, I will. Play a little bit of whack-a-mole type game. Oh! Get out of here. That did way more damage than I would have expected it to. Nuts, that did not go so well. I need to find myself uh, some endurance neurons again. Oh my god, that's like the belly of a caterpillar or something. Oh good, there's some just right here. I apologize to all these creatures that I seem to be just like running across and using as, you know, living bridges. I don't, I don't mean to do it so rudely. I don't. Dusty seems to mean to do it rudely. Oh shit, I gotta go find a, a handle from somewhere now. Where can I steal a handle from? I mean, I can take this, right? But it'll just make... Oh, I can't even take that. And I don't want it to, to re-close the stink aisle. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff over here. I didn't even think to walk past here. I was so busy trying to... I just assumed I had to turn that green guy around. Alright, let's get this one turning then and open up this new pathway. What is this? Teeth are falling out of the Holy molar. But honestly, teeth? This is kind of messed up. Ah, some of the fears are starting to come into play. Oh, there's a handle I need. Handle stuck in the tree. Well, pull harder, harder, Dusty. Oh, there we go. That was easy. Good thinking there, Piper. Thanks for the thanks for that tip. I don't have a red battery right now. Watch out! Is it like a the nightmare of having your teeth all falling out? I think it's just a fear though, not actually a nightmare. Nightmares are the like actual creatures that are running around. Fears, I guess, are just represented by physical interactions going on in this world. Oh, it was right all over his face. I'm sorry that that was all up in your face there, Mr. Caterpillar. Sorry you had to endure all that. I'm also sorry that you're just stuck like that and that you're permanently a human bridge, apparently. Whoa. To the extent that you can be a human and a bridge, you know. Whoa. Am I just making this guy run all over his own house going, bro? Let's see, can we get him to light up every single, every single window? Ah, oh, is there a pattern to it? Did I screw it up? Oh, it failed. Darn it. The first one doesn't matter. Oh, I think it depends what reaction he gives. So, bruh, the, 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 the excited sounding one means do the front door. The depressed one means go do the back door. Oh, I got you figured out, house puzzle. That's the most ridiculous sound of all time. I don't know why this guy's doing this. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, I'm very close to doing it. Oh, you're going to make me run back and forth, aren't you? Yeah, I did it. I lit up all of his things. And now, now what have I done? What have I accomplished? Oh, I got a remembrane for it. I think. Oh good, it's gonna come down to me. Yay, that's fun that there's little side puzzles you can you can take part in to discover more remembranes. And that was just an absolutely adorable one. What if I knock once more? Oh, I can't. That's unfortunate. I wonder what that seashell rock is that people seem to have out in front of their house. The other guy with the kettle had it too. I don't know if everyone has it, but that guy did as well. Ha! I need your teddy to sleep? You're such a big baby. See, it makes it look like the 
the guy that it's showing there is the one saying it and it's from my perspective so it makes it seem like Todd is maybe like a mean older brother or something like that that's what I seem to have gathered so far hello little cuckoo in your birdhouse now I'll knock you off your tree so that we can be friends and hang out and have joy together or not it seems seems kind of like I, I am not meant to disturb it and really, I don't think I want to. That's just plain mean. I wouldn't feel good about it. Watch out for them teeth. Whoa, quick dodge. And there we go. We got ourselves one more windmill running. More teeth. Jeez, what is up with this part of his brain? He's so fixated on his hatred of the dentist here. I don't know what happened to this part of his brain that made him fixate on that so, so much. The creative part of his brain is also maybe where fears are born because it, you know, you concoct the fears yourself. Full of music? Oh! This guy's singing like Dr. Seuss at me. Or you know what it actually reminds me of? It reminds me of uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, you better not say that. As far as I can tell, this is a kid's game. You pull yourself out of there, mister. Oh, I must have to... There we go. Oh, I gotta whack it back at him. I kind of suspected that might have been the case, but only a handful of them were sticking around, so you kind of gotta be on your toes. Is every third one, maybe? Whoops. Ooh, nearly missed it there. Oh, yeah, gagging on your own medicine there, are we? See how you like it, you mean old meany guy full of teeth and stuff. Now oh, you come back here and you face the music. Oh, that crumbling tooth, that rotten, rotten tooth is going to fall away. Whatever, I'll just collect all the endorphins if you're going to leave them behind. Catchy too, Dirty, rotten coward. That was a catchy tune. I like the original music in this. Oh, nice. That worked out better than I thought it would. Holy shit, can I go fishing? Hell yeah, let's go fishing. Fishy looking plant. I probably need wire or, or bait or something. I can't actually do anything right now. Well, I'll keep an eye out for something that I could maybe use to go fishing with, because yes, I absolutely want to do that. Oh, this right here. Rope with hook. It turns out this isn't a, a random side thing. This is actually where I meant to keep going since that guy took took out the tooth way of actually going. So now we get to go fishing. I love how even the scary things in this game are, like, pleasant. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Worm. Let, let me just get out of the way. There we go. I'm just trying to quickly fish. Get your dumb head out of the way. Oh, sh I screwed that up big time. I gotta wait for him to stick his head back out. Get your head out of the way. Nah. Now I just gotta wait for him to stick back out, right? Out and away! Jeez, I did not mean to, like, grab him by the neck with a sharp hook like that. I certainly hope... Oh, God, I threw him into the abyss. That guy, he's doomed. That did not work out well for that worm. Yay! Fasten your seed belt. The seed belt. Adorable! As as serious as you want to be, Dusty, everything about this is adorable and you know it. Where can I go next? Where to next? Oh, look at that. All the way across the bridge. That seems like a very long ways to go when there's other things that are much nearer, but what the hell. I'll go wherever you want to go, buddy. Look at that tree that has an ear on it. That's weird. I don't like the looks of that. I don't want to go there. It looks like we went from a windmill area to an area with more kettle rooftop things and and more trombone trumpet things. I don't know. Everything in this game is happy and lovely, and I'm so stoked about it. I can't wait to play more. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you again soon in what I'm certain will be more adorable loveliness.